Hello and welcome to ShowMeAcademy.com. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to change page orientation in Microsoft Excel 2007. When you start a new spreadsheet, by default, all the pages are aligned in a format that they call portrait. You can either have portrait or landscape. In portrait refers to the standard way that you're accustomed to seeing an 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper, meaning that the 8.5 or narrow end of the paper moves horizontally and the long side of the paper, the 11 inch side of the paper, goes up and down. But the data that you have in your spreadsheet may not always conform to that in the best way. Let me give you an example of that here. I have this spreadsheet that has NFL data in it and in this spreadsheet I'm going to go and look at the print preview. And I have data that doesn't really go down to the bottom of the page but it does go off the right end of the page. In other words, my data is wider than it is tall. However, my page layout is taller than it is wide. So what we want to do is we want to change the layout of the page. We want to print this in a landscape view rather than a portrait view so that the data more easily fits on the printed page. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this print preview. And I start off on the Home tab here when I open Excel. I'm going to move over to the page layout tab. Under page layout you'll see we have a button here for orientation and when I click this button it shows me the two options. Portrait right now is already selected and you see it gives me a graphical representation of what the page looks like under portrait and I can change it to landscape if I wish. And you can see there that the page is essentially turned on its side. So I'll click that button which now changes my, my layout to <clears throat> my orientation excuse me to landscape and now I'm going to look at my print preview again oops when I look at my print preview now you'll see that first of all the page is represented as essentially being on its side in other words the long side of the paper is across the top and the bottom and now it looks like my data much better fits onto this printed page because it basically just goes down the length of the, of the page here and then moves all the way across the width of it because we have data that is wider rather than taller. And that is how you would use the orientation to change the orientation of your page from portrait to landscape or back. This concludes the tutorial. Thank you for using ShowMeAcademy.com.